Today's episode is all about three ways to build influence through persuasion and empathy, inspired by Mob Psycho 100. Hey, this and Yoku family. Michael Yerby here at MichaelYerby.com. Coming to you straight from Shreveport, Louisiana. I'm your friendly neighborhood Air Force Master Sergeant turned personal development expert and anime junkie. Yes, you heard that right. A guy who fixes aircraft by day and bitches anime by night. And the aircraft I work on, the B-52s, are in better shape than my kitchen after a cooking experiment. My wife swears that I know how to bake. I don't know how to bake. I just know how to make cakes. Eh. Last week, we discussed three lessons civilian life can learn from military leadership with the insights from Legend of the Galactic Heroes. Remember the joke about why military leaders never play hide and seek? Because good luck hiding a fleet of starships. <laughs> well, hey, that's the jokes, guys. Bring you back. Now let's get started. Mob's journey emphasizes empathy and understanding in building influence and helping others. Have you ever tried persuading someone as calm as Mob in a crisis? It's like trying to convince your cat or dog that bath time is fun. Good luck. In today's episode, we're covering understanding and connecting with others, two, building trust through genuine empathy, and last but not least, influencing others by aligning with their values. So let's dive into these topics and learn from Mob's unique approach to influence. Let's transition from the introduction to our main content. Think of it as moving from a peaceful meditation to a full blown out psychotic battle. Quiet, intense, but full of energy. One of Mob's greatest strengths is his ability to recognize and acknowledge the emotions of others. He sees beyond the surface, understanding that everyone has their own struggles. At work, I do the same thing with my airmen, always trying to talk to them, emphasizing that their emotions are valid and they has value, and trying to understand their perspective, but also giving my perspective so I can give a holistic viewpoint and picture. This emotional awareness helps him connect on a deeper level. Imagine trying to stay calm while juggling emotions and psycho powers mob makes it look easy right <laughs> but for us mere mortals it's about listening and validating others feelings it's like when you want to tell your friend that their cooking is how you say interesting but you don't want to hurt their feelings fyi raisins do not go in potato salad i'm just saying Active listening is another powerful tool. Mob often listens more than he speaks, gives others the space to express themselves. This not only helps him understand their perspectives, but also builds rapport. Remember that time that you nodded along your friend's story only to realize you missed half of it because you was planning your next thought? Yeah, let's avoid that. Mob shows genuine interest in the people around him. Even those who might be considered his enemies, this approach disarms hostility and fosters positive interactions. It's like trying to befriend a cat who initially hates you. Patience, treats, and genuine interest can work wonders. What did we discuss? Recognizing and acknowledging emotions helps build deep connections. Active listening is crucial for understanding and rapport, and showing genuine interest can disarm hostility and foster positive interactions. Girls do it all the time. They be like, hey girl, I like your nails. Oh yeah, you like that? I like, I got the purity and pink and uh, velvet colors. They do it all the time. Now that we learned how to connect with others, let's move to building trust through genuine empathy. Think of it as leveling up from a sidekick to a hero in your personal journey. Empathy is the foundation of trust. Mob's empathy allows him to see the best in people, even when they struggle to see it in themselves. This perspective helps him build trust effortlessly. It's like seeing the potential in a rough sketch and knowing it could be a masterpiece. Being vulnerable and honest about your feelings and experiences can also build trust. Mob often shares his vulnerabilities, making him relatable and trustworthy. Think about the last time you admitted that you were scared or unsure. It probably brought you closer to the person you confided in. Like admitting that you're afraid of spiders and finding out your friend is too. The itsy bitsy spider went up the water. <laughs> Consistency in actions reinforce trust. Mob consistent efforts to help and protect others show his reliability. People trust those who are reliable. Often at work, those who are reliable are the people that you seek for counsel and that you trust because they are always being consistent in what they do. It's like expecting your favorite anime to release an episode every week. You rely on that consistency for your happiness. 
What did we discuss? Empathy is essential for building trust. Vulnerability and honesty creates reliability. Consistency in actions reinforces trustworthiness. Now let's explore how aligning with others' values can enhance your influence. It's like finding the right anime genre that clicks with your soul. Once you find it, you're hooked. Understanding the core values of others is crucial. Mark connects with people by understanding what truly matters to them. This alignment makes his influence more impactful. It's like knowing the secret recipe to your favorite dish. It makes all the difference. Aligning your actions with shared values shows authenticity. Mark's actions consistently reflect his values of kindness and protection. When your actions align with what you and others believe in, it strengthens your influence. It's like when you and your friends both agree that pineapple on pizza is a travesty. It bonds you. People say mushrooms don't belong on pizza, but those people don't have a soul. Just saying. Communicating with respect and understanding is essential. Mark always approaches others with respect, even when they oppose him. This respectful communication fosters positive influence. Imagine dealing with someone who respects your opinion, even if they disagree with you. It's refreshing and persuasive. So what do we discuss? Understanding core values enhances influence. Aligning actions with shared values shows authenticity and respectful communication fosters positive influence. As we wrap up today's episode, think of this conclusion as a final boss fight where everything comes together. In today's episode, we discussed recognizing and acknowledging emotions to build deep connections. Building trust through genuine empathy, vulnerability, and consistency. Enhancing influence by aligning with others' values and communicating with respect. Like my mom used to say, R-E-F-P-E-C-T, tell you what it means to me. But she did it with a belt. But you know, it is what it is. I want you to reflect on a recent interaction where you tried to influence someone. How can you apply empathy, trust, and value alignment to improve your approach next time? What new psychotic abilities have you discovered in your recent interactions and how did it help you connect with others? If you got an anime that you believe captures the essence of the upcoming topic even better, don't hesitate to click the link in the description and make your voice, yes, your, your voice heard. Join the waitlist for the Peak Society group at michaelyerby.com backslash the Peak Society and let's build a community where you can dive deep into discussions about growth, challenges, and of course, anime. Remember, my premium online courses are absolutely absolutely free on michaelyerby.com. Just click the course link below to tune in to your development at no cost. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share this video. Thanks for tuning in, Zenyoku family. Until next time, keep sinking persuasion, embracing empathy, and paying it forward. Peace.